Construction on Interstate 15 is in full swing right now, and the Idaho Transportation Department is already planning for what comes next. Eyewitness News 3 reporter Cole Sam shows us what's in store. If you have driven on I-15 recently, you have noticed a visible difference with traffic cones and work trucks taking center stage. This project is a part of a multi-year process to expand I-15 into three lanes between Pocatello and Idaho Falls. ITD has a lot of things going on right now. Um, we are replacing the railroad bridge at Chubbuck, and that's underway. We are doing the system interchange. Um, the largest project in Idaho right now. The ITD is hosting an open house on Thursday to discuss improvements that will be made between the Northgate Parkway interchange and the Fort Hall interchange that is set to begin in 2024. There are times where we get ideas from the community that frankly we haven't thought of. Um, we have very good engineers, but we can't think up every possible event. So we really encourage the public to come out, to speak with the engineers, ask questions, and learn more about the project. ITD Public Information Officer Justin Smith says a major priority for this project is to protect the community on the interstate. But in order to be able to do that, he says they need your help during the construction process. Safety is always one of our key issues. And we understand people get frustrated with construction throughout the state. Um, here in Idaho, we try to watch out for each other. We ask everybody to slow down, follow the posted speed limits allow others to merge and look out for the workers beside the road. With population growth and an increase in travel, Smith says this project is needed now more than ever. It's preparing us for the future. If we waited longer, we would have more delays and costs would be higher. But a lot of our in infrastructure was built in the 1960s, so it's time. Reporting in Pocatello, I'm Cole Sams. The open house will be this Thursday from 4 to 6.30 p.m. at the Shoshone Bannock Hotel and Event Center in Fort Hall.